What? We're your neighbors. They call us the little gems. I'm Pearl, and this is Ruby. That's Emmy. Gems. So you're emerald. No. Emily. And you're the spokesman. Well, I'm a reluctant leader. Ruby's too shy until she starts talking, and then we can't stop her. And Emmy's specialty is fashion. At too early an age, of course, but she can hardly help her talent. You'll find we're a little bit precocious. Precocious? What? All three of ya? Mm-hmm. But not in an annoying way. We get into scrapes and jams and trouble because we're still trying to decipher what grown-ups mean. It's not always what they say, and it makes for some hilarious misunderstandings. I bet. So you're here why? Well, we need a mentor. Mentor? What about your mothers? Our moms are our friends. Friends. Why aren't they playing with you now? Yeah, so... You're looking for a grown-up who will act like a mom. Yeah. Oh, hell no. What? First lesson, you can say no. She's the cranky neighbor. She probably lost at love. Oh, we could always be trying to find her a boyfriend and making wacky mistakes. What the hell are you talking about? That's the way it works. Haven't you read any books or seen any movies or watched any cartoons? Shut the frick up. Frick? That means fuck. Girls, this is not going to work. You're not precocious. You're pop culture devouring weasels. That was kind of mean. Unnecessarily so. Yeah, was it the weasels? What would you prefer? Pigs, piglets, bunnies. Only if they were bunnies with really big teeth. Hey, text me when you got it figured out, okay? Gerbils. No, a velociraptor. Hey, we don't have your number. Can we have your number? No, go home. Be normal. You have a little low self-esteem. You can get over it. But that's not how it works in the book. I write kids' books. Yay, we've got a mentor. Yay! Frick. She meant fuck. <laughs>